There was a wrestler, the late Hercules Hernandez, and his dog was having a litter of puppies. He called up my brother to say that if you're interested, you could have the first of the litter. My brother chose Hercules and named it after, of course, Hercules Hernandez. They were together for 13 years, and when the dog was cremated, Randy instructed my mother to get the urn, and he instructed me to pour the ashes by the tree. And I said, why me? It wasn't my dog. He says, I want you to do it because if anything happens to me, I want you to remember the spot and pour the ashes on exactly the same spot because if it's good enough for Hercules, it's good enough for me. Just a few days later, May 20th, Randy passed away. And then a few days after that, I poured half the ashes on the very same spot. And then his wife, Lynn, poured the rest of the ashes. And I'm thinking maybe he knew that he was saying goodbye because he was making peace with all the people that he had fallen out with. It's been over seven years now. I still think about him, but I think about him with love. If he had lived another 20, 30 years, it wouldn't have been any better than what he had done. He got to have all the greatest moments and live his life on his terms, and he tasted sweet success for a long period of time. But fame, if you win it, comes and goes in a minute. And so does your life, past before. But you know what? He did the best he could in the time that he had. 58 and a half years. For me, it wasn't enough. For him, it was just perfect.